joy is not determined by outward circumstances. Mm-hmm. That's the difference between joy and happiness. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. can say I'm not happy, but you can, you know, when something's going bad. But when you talk about having joy, you can still have joy amidst having problems. I know like uh, you, Luke, you have had health problems for mm-hmm. years, off and on, off and on. And so I would imagine some days that would have been, I have to choose joy today because it's not happy, you know? Early on in my diagnosis of bad health stuff, uh, that's, I, the, that's the medical term. Yeah, I don't want to be bad, too, bad too tricky stuff. for people. Uh, but. <laughs> I, uh, I, I realized like all I was getting was bad news from these people. And I was like, man, how, how can I have you know, I was off the road. How can I have some sort of influence even in a moment like this? And I was like, man, I'm going to go in there and no matter what they tell me, I'm going to do my best to just display not necessarily happiness, right? but I want to, I want to display joy to these people. And I want them to go, man, I just told that guy a lot of bad news and he's somewhat cool with it. Yeah. Where does that point to? And There's I think something that's the, different. That's the, that's the challenge I think of this song mm-hmm. is that, man, if we can choose joy day in and day out. You know, people will see yeah. a marked difference yeah. in who we are as people. And and that's, you know, a lot of people are like, hey, you wrote this song because you want other people. No. Yeah. This, 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 this song is, therapy, is a reminder man. to us. Right. When I therapy. sing it on stage, yeah. when I hear it, whatever, it's a reminder to me, yeah, I'm going to choose joy. It's an anthem for people. And I, I love it, man. And so, you know, that's what we're talking about with the guys from For King and Country. And it's, you know, it's basically one of the fruits of the spirits in, in Galatians. You know, you've got love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, all good things. But you guys chose joy. It's funny you say that because mm. we always look at the, the fruits but it's actually the fruit. It's a singular group. If you have all of these things, love is paramount. Gotcha. But right, tucked right under, un, uh, with all these great patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, self, right under love is joy. Yep. You know? And so I feel like it's, we talk about love a lot and, and, and love is a, a profound thing and love will outlast all of this. But if, if joy is tucked right underneath it, it's not this kind of glitzy, glammy Christmas joy to the world. Right. It's it's this guttural fight decision moment, like I said, moment by moment, day by day choice that we have to make that is awfully important. Because if they're going to know us by our love, maybe arguably you could say they'll know us. By our joy. joy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now, you know, you have all of these fruits of the Spirit. We're talking to the guys from For King and Country. Uh, joy seems to sing better, too, like, than I have forbearance. Like yeah, it, I choose love. Yeah, like, what if you had done I choose forbearance? Can you give me what that would sound like, a cappella? And uh, I choose forbearance. Yeah, yeah. doesn't yeah. work. Forbearance. Yeah, okay, well. Forbearance. I'm starting to see it now. <laughs> you guys might have your follow-up single You know, here. if you say it with a real distinct Australian accent, it actually... Yeah. Yeah, I choose forbearance. Yeah. Then I, oh, you're like, oh, yeah, okay. It works. Works.